All right, people. So, guys, we are back once again. Me and my buddy Joe. We are back with another episode of three movies that wrestlers play in for you guys. And uh, before, hell yeah! And before we get into it, guys, um, I got to give you all a heads up on uh, a few changes that I'm going to make to the series. First of all, I'm changing the name a little bit. I'm going to be taking off the three. And for now on, it's just going to be called Movies That Wrestlers Play In. I'm still going to be doing three movies at a time and whatnot. On top of that, uh, I'll be doing some editing with these uh, episodes where I drop in, you know, pictures, show you pictures of the wrestlers in the film itself. You know, making it a little more interesting and better and whatnot. So, with that being said, guys, let's get this fucking show on the road. <laughs> right? <laughs> Let's do this. Okay, so for now on, it's now a movie set wrestlers playing. We got three of them here, all pretty good films. First up, we got uh, Checkpoint, and then there's Grandma's Boy, and then there's uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Out of the Shadows. And I guess we'll go from uh, left to right. Starting with Checkpoint with starring Bill Goldberg. Goldberg. <laughs> yeah. WCW's Goldberg and WWE, of course. Um, this movie, uh, and, and also, isn't there, you said there was another wrestler that was in this uh, movie as well, am I right? Yeah, um, there's a, uh, a TNA wrestler named Gunner. He does a fight scene with, in the movie. Yeah, with Goldberg. I don't know much about that wrestler. Um, I only know about you know Goldberg and whatnot because I don't watch TNA that much. Um, yeah, you should. I probably should. Come on. Come on. As far as this movie goes, it's a pretty damn good film. It never hit the theaters or nothing. This was like a direct-to-video, uh, DVD and Blu-ray movie with some good casting. I mean, you got William Forsythe. He's been in a whole lot of films. Um, anything, anything with William Forsythe. Oh yeah. You know it's gonna be good. Oh yeah, William Forsythe. He was like this crazy ass biker in the movie Stone Cold with Brian Bosworth um oh yeah he was in that Steven Seagal film Out for Justice he was a crazy yeah. ass dude well, in that he movie was also in the, he was also in the Devil's Rejects right Devil's Rejects and uh it, you know and he, Zombie Halloween. yeah and he can really bring it and there's also Kenny Johnson there he I mean he's kind of well known he's in that TV show Bates Motel I believe he was in the original. Yeah. I mean, but yeah, there's some good casting in this um, uh, movie, and it's a pretty good, you know, all the action mostly is at the end of the movie. But um, if you ever get a chance to check out this film, I highly recommend you watch it. It actually shocked me when I watched it. I was expecting nothing much, but when I watched it, it had a pretty good story. Um, like I said, good casting. Yeah, Fred w Williams, Williamson is in it. My favorite, my favorite things about the movie is uh, the soundtrack. Yeah. The, the, the music in the movie. They picked some really, really good songs that set that part with that song. Yeah, yeah, they did. It, 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 I highly recommend it if you can if you see it like on DVD or Blu-ray for like I don't know five bucks or less. I would pick it up. Maybe it's on cable, though. So, Checkpoint. Yep. Check it out, guys. Check it out. Next up, guys, we're going to be moving on to a fucking great comedy film, man. Grandma's Boy. I absolutely... If you want to watch a movie that you want a nonstop laugh from beginning to end, I, I think Grandma's Boy is probably, is probably one of the funniest movies you'll ever see. Yeah, it's, it says here it's unrated. Um, a great comedy. It's about video games, grandmas, and pot smoking. 
And tell us, Joe, who's in Grandma's Boy here, buddy? We got Big Sexy, Kevin Nash. That is correct. We got Kevin Nash is in this movie around right pretty much at the beginning of the movie. Um, yeah. yeah, he's like, uh, what is he, like, taking their stuff? Yeah, he's like a mover. Him and another guy that yeah. came in. Why, 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 why the two guys are sitting there smoking pot? <laughs> yeah. Playing video games. They're moving their shit. Walk in, <laughs> and then the one guy gets up to go get a soda. Yeah. And he sees Kevin Nash, the other guy, sitting there, he's like, what's up? He's like, hey, guys. He's like, uh, who are you, and why are you in the kitchen? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's <laughs> fucking great. Yeah. And uh, he's like, yeah, yeah, so and so uh, called us up to uh, pick up your stuff. And then the guy, the one guy's like talking about Filipino hookers. And he, yeah, he's like, he's like, they're not hookers, they're massage therapists. Yeah. <laughs> and Ke Kevin Nash is like. Yeah, they'll massage your cock for money, you know. <laughs> There's a word for that. I think it's hooker? And he just yells back and he's like, you're a hooker! Yeah. <laughs> You've been spending our rent money on Filipino hookers. They're not hookers. They're massage therapists. You gotta massage your cock for money. There's a word for that. I think it's hooker. You're a hooker! I, I, yeah, I highly recommend this one. This is like a rare gem, you know, because comedies these days, they're, they're really, there's not too many good ones. And this one was a good one that came out, I think in 2006, I want to say. Something like that. Oh, yeah. But, uh, yeah, if, uh, yeah, 2006. Um, definitely check it out if you haven't seen it. I mean, great film. Yes. Yeah. I can't even count how many scenes in that movie that I probably laughed my ass Yeah, off. There's, a, there's a lot, there's a ton of great scenes and dialogue, especially with, uh, what's his name, um, who's the heavy guy's name? Why can't I remember his name? He's been in a lot of movies. It's this guy here on the back. I think his name is Jonah Hill. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, he was at a party, and that girl there is like, oh, what does she say to him? She's like, uh, oh, she's like, uh, she grabs her at one point and goes, uh, and, and takes down her top to yeah. show her tits. Yeah. And he, she, he just goes, baby, you want milk? And yeah. he looks at her, at her tits and goes, uh, Baby like <laughs> yeah, he's like baby love milk and starts sucking her boob for the whole night. I'm like, damn. Yeah. <laughs> and it's yeah, it's just crazy shit like that. It's a good film. But anyways, we're gonna be moving on to our last film of the day. Um <laughs> Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Out of the Shadows. I got the steel book here, Blu-ray. And tell us, Joe, what wrestler is in this movie? Oh, the Celtic Warrior, Seamus. Seamus. He's in this movie. He plays uh, Rocksteady. In it. And uh, I haven't seen this in a while, so I don't remember a whole lot about it. But it, it's it's a decent film. It doesn't compare to the originals. Like the original films, way no, better. Not, not not the turtle movies that we grew up with. Yeah. I mean, no, I mean, we learned some of the girl cake. Yeah. It's just that I mean, I like the you, you know the fact that you know they kind of went over the top with designing the, 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 the turtles. Well, they don't even look, look like turtles. They look well, more like like aliens. Well, they're more. I think they're uh, you know, also they're CGI this time around, and last time they were you know outfits, puppets. Yeah, you know. I'm saying you know, I mean, if you look at them though, they don't even look like I say like turtles. They look just they look like I don't know, like Incredible Hulk type. Movies. Right. They're, they're definitely bigger and whatnot. But, I mean, all in all, the, the films are not too bad. They're not great, but they're not, like, bad. Yeah, they're not, like, I mean, they're, they're, to me, they're watchable. 
Yeah, they're decent. I give them that. But yeah, they put Seamus in this film, which is pretty cool. Um, and uh, whatnot. So hell yeah, man. And I, and I have to admit too that Megan Fox as April O'Neil don't make it that bad either. Yeah, I mean she does an all right job with it. <laughs> so there you have it, guys. Uh, that's uh, another episode of uh, you know movies that wrestlers play in. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys uh, like the little changes that I've made to these uh, series from here on out. And uh, I guess that's it, right? Yeah, we'll, we'll catch y'all again with yeah. another three movies that wrestlers played in. Yeah, we'll do it again in the future for that. For um, I guess that's it. So we're out of here. <laughs> Yeah, later on. All right, guys. Peace out. Later.